Welcome to Amish Math School. The learning topics of this video is find the side length when the length of medians given for any triangle. That is the relationship between the median and the side of any triangle. Let's start the topics find the side using the medians. That is for any triangle this one where the first vertex is A, B and the C. These three are the vertex of this triangle and Opposite of this vertex A, the side length is A, and opposite of this vertex B, the side length is B, and opposite of C, the side length is C. This A, B, C indicate the length of side of this triangle ABC, and this one is the median and whose length is D. This one is another median whose length is E, and the another median whose length is F. The main aim of this video is to find the length A, B and C of this triangle ABC when this median length that is D, E and F is given. So what will be the formula? In this video we will discuss about the formula, some examples and how the formula comes. So the using the median D, E and F if we want to find the value of the side that is A, in that case the value of A will be 2 by 3 square root of 2 times e square plus f square minus d square. That is this e, f and this a. These, these three are involved here. So a is equal to 2 by 3 times the square root of 2 times this e square plus f square then minus this d square. And similarly for b, these two sides is involved here. So for the value b, that is b equal to 2 by 3 times square root of 2 times d square plus f square minus e square. And for the side c, that is d and e involved here, that's why c is equal to 2 by 3 times square root of 2 times d square plus e square minus f square. So these three are the formula to find the value of the length of side a, b and c when the length of median, that is d, e and f are given. If we substitute the value of D, E and F in this formula, we can easily get the value of the side of triangle that is A, B, C. Now let's see how can we get the formula. Suppose this one is the triangle. This three length is A, B and C as previous. And here this Z is 2 ratio 1 inner division point of any median. That is if we consider this median, so this point is 2 ratio 1 inner division point. That is, this part is 2 and this part is 1. The length of one medium, if we consider this one is D and each part of equal 3 division is D by 3. That is, if we divide this D, that is this median into 3 equal part, then each part will be D by 3. So, according to this line, that is, Z is the 2 ratio 1 inner division point. The length of AZ is 2d by 3 because here the two part here one part so az is equal to 2d by 3 and this part is d by 3 so if we write here az equal to 2d by 3 and other part is d by 3 if we add these two we can easily get the value that's d because the length of this median is d similarly for this median also we can write this part is 2e by 3 and this part is only e by 3. If we sum these two, the result will be e. Also, for this median, there is 2 f by 3 this part, and the other part is f by 3. If we add these two, in that case, the value will be f. Consider this triangle, this one. In this triangle, this d by 3 is the median, and the side length for this triangle is 2 f by 3, 2 e by 3, and other part is a. So, in this triangle, just one side A is involved and other three is come from the three median. That is, this part is 2F by 3, this part is 2E by 3 and this part is D by 3, which is the median for this small triangle. So, according to the Apollonius theorem, we know Apollonius theorem is relate the side with the median. So, we can write for this triangle, the value of this median that is d by 3 square, which is equal 2 times, that is 2e by 3 whole square plus 2f by 3 whole square minus this a square divided by 4. We get this relationship between the median and side from this Apollonius theorem. For this triangle, 
this d by 3 is the median and this e 2e by 3 2f by 3 and this a are 3 side length of this triangle so we can write d by 3 square is equal to 2 times 2e by 3 whole square plus 2f by 3 whole square minus a square divided by 4 now if we simplify this line we can write this 4 is here that is multiplied with d square by 3 that is 4 times d square by 3 equal to 2 times 2e by 3 whole square plus 2f by 3 whole square minus a square. And we are going to find the value of a, that is the length of side of this triangle. So we can write here a square equal to 2 times 2e by 3 whole square plus 2f by 3 whole square minus 4 times d by 3 whole square. So after simplification, we can also write a square equal to 4 by 9, 2 times e square plus f square minus d square. So the a is equal to 2 by 3 square root of 2 times e square plus f square minus d square. Since this a is the length, so we just average here the negative part. a is equal to 2 by 3 square root of 2 times e square plus f square minus d square. Using this d, e, f, we can easily find the value of a. That is the side length for this triangle. This is the formula for the side and the median relationship. Here, from this triangle, we get this value that is a equal to 2 by 3 square root of 2 times e square plus f square minus d square. Similarly, for this triangle, this one, that is involving this side b, here we can write b equal to 2 by 3 times square root of 2 times d square plus f square minus e square. That is, this part and this part. These two parts are for, comes from d and f. So, 2 times d square plus f square minus e square. That is this part. This part is come from E. So that's why B equal to 2 by 3 times square root of 2 times D square plus F square minus E square. And for this triangle, so the value of C is equal to 2 by 3 square root of 2 times D square plus E square minus F square. This 2 is D and E. So D square plus E square minus F square. So C equal to 2 by 3 square root of 2 times d square plus e square minus f square. These three are the formula to find the side length of any triangle when the length of median are given. That is, the length of median is here d, e, and f, and the length of sides are a, b, and c. These three are the relating formula of side and the medians of any triangle. Now, let's see one example. That is, when the value of the median is given here, this median length is 6, this median length is 7, and this median length is 8. The value of A will be 2 by 3 square root of 2 times 7 square plus 8 square minus 6 square. 2 times the sum of the square of these two minus this value. That is 2 times 7 square plus 8 square minus 6 square. The square root of that value times 2 by 3, which is the value of A. After calculation, we can get the value of this side is approximately 9.19 and similarly the b is equal to 2 by 3 square root of 2 times 6 square plus 8 square minus 7 square which is 8.19 approximately and for the c the value is 2 by 3 square root of 2 times 6 square plus 7 square minus 8 square which is approximately 6.86 so here the length of 3 median is given here 6 7 and 8 and for these three median we have the side length of this triangle is a is equal to 9.19 b is equal to 8.19 and c is equal to 6.86 approximate using this formula we can easily find the side length of any triangle when the length of median are given